Hi, I'm Cassandra Miklowski with Keller Williams, and thank you for visiting my real estate blog. Today we'll be talking about the benefit of home buying versus renting. Before we get started, I'd like to point out two tools on my website. First is the free home valuation tool, which gives you an estimate for what your home is worth. And two, there's a home search available for you at no extra charge. Today we'll be talking about home buying versus renting. Many people ask me, should I rent? Should I buy? I don't know what's happening in the real estate market. So my opinion is this, when you buy a home, you are investing in your future. Real estate can be sold at any time, but it also can be passed down to other family members. I know many people who have had homes in their family for multiple generations. So it's not only for you, but if you think about passing it on to your children and their children, it certainly can be looked at as an investment opportunity. Two, the rental market, especially in the Northern California area, is crazy. We are seeing rents now that are more expensive than a mortgage. So in my opinion, why would you pay more to rent somebody's home than you would be to invest in your own home? Secondly, if you're renting a home, then that homeowner has control over your future. So if you're in a rental situation and your contract comes up and it's expired and you'd like to either renew on a month to month or an annual basis, the people that own the home that you're renting have the opportunity to either increase your rent or tell you that they've made another decision with the rental and then you're then looking for another home. In that situation, you're at the mercy of them. Third, there's also a tax break that comes along with it. You should speak to an accountant or your tax attorney to find out about the benefits that would come with you for either having a rental and or a primary resident. It's also cheaper over the long term if you think about the time and money that you'll spend even on a rental. Uh, people talk about you know doing little things here or there to fix up the property instead of waiting for your landlord. If you own your own home, that would be time and money that you spend putting it into your own home. Also, if you look at it from a credit perspective, most creditors are looking for you to be able to have purchased a home, bought a car, or making revolving type of credit payments. If you own a home, that's a large lump sum where they can see consistent history year after year after year. So if you do own a home, then that allows you to continue to build your credit. And finally, if I think about the money that I work so hard for my family and my future, if I could put my money somewhere, it would be in my home instead of paying off my landlord's rent and mortgage. If you have any further questions about real estate, please contact me at 916-844-6360. And again, it's Cassandra Niklewski from Keller Williams. Thank you.